Hello, and welcome to Tom Debates Tom. I'm Tom Merritt, and I will be debating my friend Tom Merritt about a topic as I do every week. Now, this week, the topic is encrypt all the things. I don't even know how you could possibly object to this. Encrypt all the things, if you don't know, means that we should put encryption on every piece of data that we possibly can. The reason for that is that encrypted data is much safer than data that is not encrypted. And in this world where pretty much every day we hear about a new data leak, a new data hack, a new piece of data that got out that shouldn't have, encryption by default is really the only sensible position you can have. Because if something is encrypted and it gets out, it's almost worthless. Unless it has weak encryption, right? But when we're saying encrypt all the things, we mean encrypt all the things at a strong level. Now, eventually, someday, quantum computers will come along and, and that'll make it easy to, to break that stuff. But by then, that data will potentially not be that valuable anymore because it's a ways down the road. So encrypt all the things is the default position. And there's no exception to it. Well, it must be nice to be that rich, huh? Encrypting things slows stuff down. It increases costs. It decreases productivity. Now you could say, but Tom, we have to be safe. We, we have to keep our data from being leaked. I'm not going to disagree with you on that. Mm -hmm. I'm not an idiot. Jury's but out. encrypt all the things means what? Encrypt my name? My login name? Should I encrypt my Twitter posts that I publicly share with the world? No, it's ridiculous. Encrypt all the things is ridiculous overreach. It makes things slow, it makes things expensive. And I guess if you're rich and you can afford the fastest computers, yeah, great. Encrypt all the things, but the rest of us real people, we need responsible encryption of the things that need to be encrypted, not just some blanket rich man solution. Well, I see you brought class into it. Yeah, right. All right, that's fine. Look. Encrypt all the things, I will admit, could be overreach. <laughs> could now, be, it is. Do yes. we need to encrypt Thank every you. single piece of public data? Probably well, not. But the principle of encrypt all the things is meant to say we know people aren't going to do this. So instead of saying, could you please encrypt the right things, which is what we've been doing till now, saying please encrypt the right things, encrypt all the things says don't try to guess what should be encrypted by default. Assume it should be encrypted. I guess the moderate position that I might admit to you is that you could make a justification for encrypting some things, for not encrypting some things, but you need to work in that direction. You need to work in that way and assume that all things should be encrypted if you can't make that justification otherwise. <laughs> oh, do you feel that breeze? You feel that backpedaling? <sighs> Ah, feels good. It's cooling me off. I'm not so angry anymore with all that backpedaling going on. Yeah, all right. Well, so, in other words, encrypt all the things isn't the default position. It's a way to treat us all like children and say, we don't trust you to actually encrypt the right things, so we're just going to tell you to encrypt all the things. Then maybe you'll encrypt some of the things. It, it, it's crap. It's a crap realization. It's a crap rationalization. And honestly, all we need is people to encrypt the right things. It's not that hard to figure out the right things, right? We know what they are. Uh, sensitive information, their credit card information. Encrypt the stuff you need to keep private. That seems like a reasonable way to go. Why don't we just say that? Can you backpedal a little more and meet me there, Tom? Huh? Sure, yeah. Uh, encrypt the things that should be private. And that's easy, right? Because everybody agrees what should be private. Oh, I mean, wait. Pretty much, yeah. No, they don't. How about we just stay right where I am? I ain't gonna backpedal at all. We should encrypt all the things. Unless you can come with, with a good reason why it shouldn't be encrypted. And your points earlier about this being a rich man's game, honestly, encryption is so advanced these days, it does not slow things down like it did in the 1990s where you seem to be stuck. Encryption is too important to say, well, it might slow something down a tiny little bit. I would much rather have encryption, and I think most people agree with me, that they would rather have their data safe than have a slightly speedier computer. So there we go. I rest my case. That's the end. No, you can't just call me 90s man and just, just. Sorry, that's the end of the show. Thanks everybody for joining us. Please let us know what you think about this issue in the comments and encrypt all the things. Not all of them.